What up YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be building this. It's the enclosure for my 3D printer which I've been meaning to do for freaking ages. Um, just made out some IKEA furniture so let's get into it. Okay we're just kicking this off then by assembling the main box itself. Uh, then we're going to go and attach the front door with the hinges. Um, all the links will be in the description. So if you want to do this mod yourself, then you can if you've got an IKEA near you. Okay, one thing to note here if you're doing this project yourself is the hinges actually line up perfectly with the holes inside the uh, box itself that would normally be used for shelves, so no drilling required. Okay, now we've got the uh, the enclosure itself built, um, like the main box of it or whatever, we're going to be cutting some wood and uh, like sanding it and painting it to fit on the top for the filament holder to attach to uh, this is so it's high enough um, so that when we put a roll of filament on it won't rub on the, um, the box or anything like that okay here we're just applying some epoxy resin to the wood bracket that's going to be attached to the um, original filament holder that was on the printer uh, this is just for a bit more strength because the box itself is made of like a fibre board so this is just to add a bit of strength so the screws aren't just um, doing all the work themselves Okay, in this last step, we're just sticking on some regular door draft excluder, which uh, you can get locally from uh, any hardware store. And it's just to stop the uh, uh, any hot air from escaping, any cold air from getting in, just keep the heat, heat in longer in the actual enclosure itself while it's printing. So there you have it, there's the completed build. I think I'm going to do a part two to this, which will have uh, probably some, me put some the LED lights inside of it. Um, I'm going to 3D print a filament guide because that hole is not the best. And um, something else I was going to do as well. Anyway, it'll all become clear in the next video. But anyway, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed, please like, comment, and subscribe. It helps me out a lot. And I'll see you next time. Ta ta!